What is going on guys? We are back with some FIFA on the channel and I was waiting for one of these mods to be available. FIFA 23, uh, It's this is going to be a modded career mode. Of course, yes, on FIFA 22. Uh, most will understand that. Uh, of course, right at the start of the video, if you're excited for it, leave a big like on the video and that, that we're bringing back FIFA. Uh, it's going to be a good build up to the FIFA 23 game. The last year, we're going to be calling it FIFA as well, but we're not going to get all into that information about EA Sports versus FIFA. Uh, but yeah, this is going to be pretty good because because we'll have updates of the mod as we go through. If you think it might look a little basic, like it just got that FIFA 23 text in the top corner, uh, but there's kits, transfer updates, and of course, we're not going to have all the updates like in a few weeks because we would have had already started the career mode. And you know, career mode is about transfers. Teams make transfers within it. But yeah, it's generally we're going to get close like as close as we can to uh to what's available right now to be having uh, kind of a fifa 23 modded career mode so let's get things started so of course we go in to start the standard manager career mode we go in to do an authentic club career mode maybe i'll do a creator club next year i didn't do one uh, this year in fifa 22 uh but you know yeah it was that kind of thing where it's a cool new feature but yeah i was a bit off this game uh, this year or fifa 22 anyway <laughs> Wait, we chose authentic career. Why is Man City club uh, authentic club? Come on, Man City in there. But now, of course, yeah, you can see like yeah, you got Bournemouth in there. We're gonna be Arsenal. We know that for sure. And you can see the kits. Uh, six teams, like you know, the top teams in the Premier League are the ones that's updated. Uh, like Chelsea in there, like Liverpool. Yeah, mentioned Man City, but they are a top team. Man United as well. Of course, Nottingham Forest, one of the updated teams with Fulham in terms of being, yeah, the one's promotion. So, yeah, the one with kits updates and transfer updates. Well, every team has transfer updates uh, to this point. But yeah, it's the big teams with the kit updates. Yeah, the big teams and Spurs. So we just change. There's dollars by default, but we, yeah, go to sterling, pounds. You know, you're playing in England. Kind of makes sense. Uh, let's get the career started. Oh, of course, we can't forget FIFA career mode big new feature the press conferences uh anyway uh let's see what pre-season tournament we do we are going to play just one game like like this was a new game like a new fifa game like i would do in those series uh because yeah you want to maybe just see the gameplay get the feel of the yeah fifa 23 mod here uh this one's the most prize money so i reckon we go with that maybe it's not the hardest one just how it's balanced but yeah we're just going to go into it so there, if we head over to the squad, you're going to see Jesus. I don't know why he gets a negative one, but you're just going to take that. You get Vieira. And yeah, we know other transfers, both in and out, are going to be made. But we can't add the future transfers. And yeah, there couldn't be predicted transfers made. It all makes sense. Ramsdale, a very good goalkeeper. He got a bit of an upgrade in his rating as well. So... This is where we're going to get into a game, but I want you guys to get involved. I really like the subscribers to, you know, leave your thoughts and uh, I really want to get you guys involved in terms of the signings and everything we do in the career mode. So get your suggestions in uh, for this episode. That'll be great to see and I'll feature your guys' comments in the following video and see who was really yeah demanded and not just transfers, but yeah, how you generally want the career to go. But for me... This is not the strongest team. Lukonga, drop out. Might be a good player for the future. Tierney. Tavares, again, maybe good for the future. And Sed... Oh, my gosh. Tomiyasu. Like, it's not the strongest team, the default. And just so you see, yeah, who, yeah, who's the rest of the players there. So if there's most recent signing, maybe in the last day or two, or players released, players sold, yeah. And even if you're watching this in a few days or a few weeks, consider when we made this. So we're going to leave it like that. Obviously, Jesus, he's the big, yeah, he's the big transfer. I think he'll have a very good season. Um, yeah, the upcoming Premier League season as well. Of course, pretty decent budget to be working with. Oh, yeah, we get a scout report as well. Like, okay, what's the expectations uh, for Arsenal? Shouldn't be anything too high. Uh, we're looking at brand exposure is what is critical. Sign three players from South America. See, hey, this is put in. If you guys can connect any uh, realistic signings within those parameters and get a streak of three clean sheets in away matches, that's going to be a nice little challenge. Uh, we, 
do. See, I'd like full. I like even though this is a priority and what the in the game what we want. I'd like you guys maybe set challenge for me as well. As I said, get involved with those kind of things. Uh, will be pretty fun. So finish top four and win the FA Cup. So I. I I feel finishing top four would be easier. Just going all the way in FA Cup, yeah, you can't lose. <laughs> so, yeah, you're allowed to drop points in the league. But, yeah, we'll see how we go. I think top four is achievable. So, we see how we do. I like how Aaron Ramsey and Aaron, uh, Aaron Rat we know. That is not the Aaron Ramsey that comes to mind. So, we deleted that message. Let's go to the Youth Academy. Ooh, someone's looking decent. So, and, yeah, there's always that one. I mean, his potential looks all right. Wow, ugh, he's not the best one. But let me know if we should focus on the youth players anyway so much. We can scout anyway and get someone good. Uh, or do we, yeah, try and focus on some real transfers, trying to make this realistic as possible, uh, as much as you can anyway in FIFA. Not much to speak of. For him being the key player, yeah, he's got a bit of weaknesses. Yeah, you know the budget we have. Yeah, you guys don't hesitate with all your suggestions. Get lots of comments in. So there we go. Just want to show you like how the overall, like the, you know, the font, how, yeah, the rating number looks, just keep in mind you might get crashes. <laughs> this is not the perfect world. Reload again. And a wild Erling Haaland appears. Just, hey, gives you a reason, you know, gives me a reason to show you uh, this is there. Uh, that's kind of like the screen, the main screen before you head into the game. So yeah, that actually caused it to crash trying to deal with Odegaard's message. So I want to figure that out so we get this first episode done. So yeah, we'll worry about that. Because we just want to get a first game in. So here we go. There's the kit. There's, yeah, perfect. Jay Isn't that? Isn't that perfect? He's looking pretty good in the Arsenal kit. So let's get things underway. I mean, it's pre-season. So yeah, in this FIFA 23 mod, modded career mode, maybe take a look. Who do we... Do we want to see anyone else? Maybe we will bring Vieira off the bench. So, yeah, you, you see him coming on. I think that will fit all right. Yeah. Not bad. See, Pepe. I think Pepe is... Is he, like, close to leaving as well? That's what I mean. There's so much chance of rumours. Maybe, yeah, Martinelli. I like the midfield. Some good options there. Sporting is a decent test. Is it, yeah, a game we should win and then, like... Yeah, we, we you need to still play well. You still need to play well. But yeah, you should be beating Sporting with Arsenal, new signing of Jesus. And yeah, I thought legendary, especially for a preseason game. And we'll just wait. We'll get a gauge of how we're doing during the season. Like That just makes sense. That, yeah, we'll try and play. If we're winning a lot of games easily, we upgrade to ultimate. If it seems to be a fair level, yep, uh, for some competitive football, and the games are actually a good viewing. Yeah, that's what we want the most. So let's get into this first match here. Here we go, Sky Sports Live. And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football. A nice little hit out this will be for us today. And there is the main man himself, Jesus. Got to win this. That was just oh, a taller man. Ramsdale. What do you... I mean, realistic. He has to make a lot of saves for Arsenal, doesn't he? And, yeah, he... Easy save there, but... Oh, they had a big... Strike. Oh, Jesus! Oh, my God. I was trying to... I want to show him off today. I want to show him off a little bit. Not him get injured. Hopefully, he doesn't get forced off and he just works it out. All right. See, what I like, man... We're not going to overanalyze so much. Let's just focus on the game. Jesus. Hopefully he can just work it out, but uh, movement. Yeah, we don't want to... Okay, come on. Let's get a good start. Oh, he looks... Yep. Jesus is fine. Oh, he could get involved here. Now. That's perfect timing. That's perfect timing. Blast it. How long did it take? Not very long, clearly. There he is. There he is. Talk about a way that I would have wanted it perfect to yeah, kick off here. He just went bang into that top corner. Hopefully more of that to come from Jesus. Yeah, good powerful strike. Neat goal. When we had some early play to focus on defensively. You love to see it. But yeah, he's got that. Yeah. 
He's got that quickness, but that exciting ability as well. I know exciting is not an attribute, but let's focus. I'm just on. Because, you know, they will be now. Because they're, yeah, they're a goal down. We know how that works. They step up their ability a little bit, and I didn't even press, press to clear that, to be honest. They're going to find their way through. No, 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 no. I want to keep a clean sheet. Yeah, I want to just have a kind of close enough to faultless first game here in the first episode. Come on, Ramsdale. Grab that. Grab that. Uh, now I mentioned it, we probably will concede. Come on, Ramsdale. Come on. Okay. We managed there well-ish. Now, Gabriel... Smith Rowe, exciting talent, knows how to score goals. We know that. Oh, pulls a free kick. I was trying to do that, I promise. <laughs> it worked out anyway. I mean, it's either that or get past them. You'd like to get past them, but we don't have too many men forward. And that didn't have the right connection. And is that... That's going to be a goal kick. Okay. I'm surprised that we didn't have more players in the tower. We have, we've gone straight into a match, guys. Like, we haven't even messed with tactics or anything. So, another thing to keep in mind. Maybe that's what we've got wrong previous time. Trying to overanalyze it. Let's just play the game as it is. Jesus. Get it back to him. Oh! <laughs> Oh, sorry, Thomas. Sorry for not being excited that you scored. I should be. <laughs> oh, that was decent effort. Jesus is exciting. He is exciting, I tell you that much. That much is for sure. You got to leave a thumbs up for him on this episode. Let's go. Of course, guys, there's going to be FIFA 22 ad boards. Um, yeah, I think, like, through my commentary and all that, definitely, you know, I'm, I'm trying to make it well aware this is not actually FIFA 23, but it's a mod. So, like, you got the kits and updated transfers because, you know, there's going to be that one guy in the comments. But there's FIFA 22 ad boards. This is, this is FIFA 22. <laughs> there will be that guy. People with the head screwed on get it. <laughs> yeah, for sure. But... Odegaard. Wait till this ball goes through. Yeah. And just go low. Just go low. Hey, no, Ian, this is not like, yeah, let's go right away to ultimate. I want to see how we go in the Premier League season because we are the better side. Yeah, are the better side here today. So, good, good. I'd rather have a good game than a bad game. That is for sure. Let's go. We're back in action on FIFA. Jesus, we know what we want to do here. Oh, ho, 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 almost just scooted past them. But we got to defend. It doesn't matter. Like, I don't want to concede one goal, man. We just want to focus. Yes, come on. Come on, guys. Odegaard, right idea. And it might work out. No, it doesn't work out. Like someone who's carrying a few extra kgs. Here we go. We're through. Oh, and he pulls a penalty. Send him off. Send, it, it's probably not a red, but... Come on. Just... It's pretty simple to do, mate. Don't be, don't be acting like you're one of the pro FIFA players, but we definitely don't proclaim to be that. I mean... I mean... J Zeus. Just try and... Yeah, reasonable. 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 Decent hit. And he's got another one. He can't be stopped. Yeah, good finish. Uh, yeah, we want to see Vieira in some action. Even though Odegaard, yeah, one of the best players, he's very good for us. 
And even Jesus, he does might need to train him, striker to be his main position, but it just shows you that warning. <laughs> if a player is quality, he's going to be that. It's, yeah, it's really not an issue. Martinelli as well, come on for Smith Rowe. And Ketia has, don't worry, yeah, Jesus. He got, yeah, he, he did his thing. He, he did enough in this game. So we bring on Eddie, bring on Enketia. Yeah, had a good 60 minutes. And it just, that's a good vibe, like, for the fans. They'll like to see him, you know, make sure he doesn't overdo it. You know, get a good 60 minutes, show his goal scoring and his general play is just, yeah, top quality. And, yeah, there he is. Jesus. The new number nine at Arsenal, ready to do big things. Okay, defend. Yeah, went safe. Yep, safe-ish. <laughs> All right, we got to defend. Paulinho defended everything coming our way. Gabriel just stand strong, stand strong in front of your man. <laughs> I like how I'm getting hyped up against sporting. Here we go. Let's get it. Oh, not quite for Eddie. If we just play this out by keeping a cleanie, a clean sheet. Come on. No. Ramsdale, I'll tell you what, that I should have cleared it. No, don't get it. I, it was always coming. It was always coming. It kept going back to them. They don't want me to have a faultless defensive performance. Yeah, mate. Get out of my face, please. <laughs> like, look, get a block. A second block and win the goal. Uh, sometimes you could only do so much. But I'm going to work on defending better. As I said, I'm not going to be about complaining too much about it. But just, yeah, work on what we can do better there. Maybe, you know, block the ball, even though we already did a couple times. Yeah. Something to work on. Kind of. Like... My reference is, what can we work on? <laughs> How much more blocks can you make? Any more blocks and we be playing Minecraft. But, yeah, hopefully we train Vieira up as well and becomes... Yeah, he still needs to develop a bit extra to, like, I, I think, to make impact in Premier League games. Just being a mid-70s. Yeah, get into the 80s and he can, yeah, match with our squad pretty well, which I'm confident in. So, yeah, we'll definitely utilise him. But, yeah, we definitely got our goals on the board today. And even just to show you, um, on Legendary, they they can get a goal when they want to. Yeah, they definitely can get, they can score when they want. But, yeah, uh, good game, good game. Jesus, <laughs> that wasn't even one of his goals, was one of his most dangerous moments in the game. Yeah, after he got that first, he was looking so good, Jesus. We always knew there was a second coming. There we go, advance, 4-1. So, yeah, we're going to leave it there. And as I said, when I tried to delete one message, it was, yeah, the feedback, at least, from Odegaard. We dealt with other messages and we'll be fine. So if some messages we don't check out and show you guys in the video, it's because it leads to crashes. And, yeah, we're just going to manage around that. Uh, but hopefully you enjoy the FIFA 23 vibes. Just to reiterate then, uh, once more, Obviously, this is not the actual FIFA 23 game. Yeah, the wise people know. But yeah, we just want to have the closest feel as possible uh, with this FIFA 23 mod. As you said, we'll leave a link in the description so you can download it. I'll leave some details uh, there as well. Like which teams have their updated transfers and... Um, well, no, all, all teams updated transfers. You mean the kits and promotions, relegations, and all those other stuff, a bit of information, some updated faces as well for certain players. I'm not sure actually any players at Arsenal, but uh, yeah, if you're wondering about uh, anyone else, we're going to leave it there. If you guys can smash a like on the video, greatly appreciated. Subscribe so you don't miss the videos. Obviously, later in the year when FIFA 23 does drop. I say later, it's a couple of months away. Not that far, really. So, yeah, this will be a good build-up. We'll be making a lot of content. I'll leave it there for now. Catch you guys next time.